Church House. And we want to read together the 7th through the 13th verse. Revelation. Third chapter. Reading. Starting our reading at verse 7 and reading through the 13th verse of the third chapter. When we all have it, say amen. 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 Need more time, say hold on. Seven says, and to the evangel of the church to Philadelphia write. These things says he who is holy, he who is true, he who has the key of David, he who opens and no one shuts, and shuts and no one opens. I know your works. See, I have set before you an open door, and no one can shut it. When you have a little strength, have kept my word, and have not denied my name. Indeed, I will make those of the synagogue of Satan, who say they are Jews and are not, but lie. Indeed, I will make them come and worship before your feet, and to know that I have loved you, because you have kept my command to persevere. I also will keep you from the power of trial, which shall come upon the whole world, to test those who dwell on the earth. Behold, I am coming quickly. Hold fast what you have, that no one may take your crown. He who overcomes, I will make him a pillar in the temple of my God, and he shall go out no more. I will write on him the name of my God, and the name of the city of my God, the new Jerusalem, which comes down out of heaven from my God, and I will write on him my new name. the wilderness and 
many uh, 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 became unbelievers. <laughs> many turned back on God, but yes. but that was a remnant that believed God. Amen. God has established the church on those who were Amen. faithful. Amen. 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 When we look at the New Testament community, it, it identified faith primarily with trust in God. Yes. The emphasis of Jesus' teaching is trust in God, not, not only for his great power which can accomplish miracles, but also for his loving concern for the, the necessities of human life. Amen. You know, sometimes we tend to forget that God really cares about what's going on with us day by day. Yes, he does. Yes, he does. Thank God, you, God cares whether you got clothes on your back and a roof over your head. So sometimes we forget to talk about how much God cares about us. I, I, I told Deacon Larkin as we talked in the office earlier that that when I realized the scripture when it said, while I was yet in my sin, God died for me. Yeah. While I wasn't worthy of anything yeah. but that, yeah. God sent Jesus to redeem me from my sin. Yeah. But when you, when you look at the word of God, you find that, that God sent Jesus to uh, rescue the people that had broken God's law. Amen. The ones who were uh, thought worthy of the punishment that God gave to us, told us about when he saved us. Yeah. Amen. And yet God, in his loving kindness, saved us from a faith. Amen. Amen. When you think about that, you, you have to think about how good God really is. Amen. 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 Because none of us, and I, I, I listen to uh, Deacon Palmer always talking about that we all were something to the else before we became saved. Amen. 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 And sometimes we forget that even in our something else, God was with us. Amen. Amen. I, I dare to say that there were probably some people who were doing some things on yesterday that they shouldn't have been doing. Amen. Yet God woke us up all this morning and Amen. gave us an opportunity to come and worship Him. Amen. Now there are those who chose not to today. Mm -hmm. Amen. But God still woke them up. Let, let, right. let, 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 let me tell you, God didn't have to allow anybody to wake up this morning. Amen. 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 So those who were, were, were still up doing what they do, partying or whatever, when the morning came. Yeah. Amen. <laughs> They, they're missing out on an opportunity. Amen. Amen. Because this is an opportunity to worship and thank God for, for what he's done for you. And, and let, let me tell you something. If you, if you ain't got nothing to worship and thank him for, then you really ought to be worshiping Come him. Come on. Amen. Amen. Right. Amen. 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 Because it's only through our praise, and we say it all the time, when our praises go up, the blessings come down. Some of us ought to be in a state of praise continually all day, every day. Amen. Looking for and anticipating that which God has already promised that he'll do. Amen. Amen. When the Apostle John indicated that those who believe in Jesus would have eternal life. Amen. Paul said faith is believing in what we cannot see. Amen. Faith is the substance of things hoped for and the evidence of things not seen. The, the faithful church trusts God Amen. to see them through the storms of life. And, 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 and it causes us to, to want to learn 